Hi everybody. So for today's drawing, we're gonna draw a picture of you and dad because this weekend is Father's Day. So it'll be a nice picture that you can give to dad. So I'm gonna help you draw the bodies and the heads, but it's gonna get a little bit tricky because I want you to make it look like you and dad. So after we do that, then I'll show you different hairstyles that you guys can add. And then when you color, you can make it the color of your eyes. You can even add a shape of your nose. If you wanted, you could do a different smile than I'll do, and you can add your teeth. I know some of you have teeth that are missing already. So we're gonna start with dad. We're gonna start with his head. And remember, my, my paper is landscape today, so long ways. So I'm gonna draw a picture of dad's head over here. Nice circle. Now I'm gonna curve it down this way. There. And then I'm gonna leave this side blank because we wanna add his um, shoulders there in just a second. So his shoulders are gonna come all the way from the bottom of the paper. They're gonna curve up and they're gonna get straight right here at his head and they're gonna come back down to the bottom of the paper. So when I curve up, I'm gonna meet that line where I stopped at my head, go straight across and then come down. There's dad's shoulders. Good. And so what we're gonna do is give dad a tie. So he's gonna have a little half circle here. It's gonna be the top of the tie. All right, and then the bottom of the tie is gonna curve down and it's gonna get wider as we go. And when I get to the end, I'm gonna curve it up and then straight back up, get skinnier as I go. So it comes skinny here and then it gets wider as you go down. And then we're gonna add him some collar shirt tucks over here. So just triangles on both sides of your little tie circle. There we go. And then we'll come up and give dad some eyes. So we're gonna give him some oval shaped eyes. One, two, there's your two eyes. And then you can add pupil in there and a circle around it. Circle around it, good. And then I'm gonna give him a little nose, just a little upside down U there. If you wanna do a different nose, you're more than welcome to. And then for his smile, I'm just gonna give him a big smile. There it is. And then I'm gonna give those little curves at the top that show that he's got some cheeks. Good, so there's dad. Then we're gonna come over here and we're gonna work on um, you. You're gonna be wrapped around dad, giving him a hug. So your head is gonna come right over here next to dad. There we go. And I'm gonna leave a little bit of space here because I want you to be able to have an arm coming down. All right, so then I'm gonna give you some eyes, oval eyes. Oval eyes, a little curve in there, there's your pupils, and then same thing, I'm going to give you a little nose, and then a big smile, there you go, don't forget those little curves, good, and then we're going to work on your arms, so we left a little space here, so we're going to start with this one, and we're gonna curve inward. And when you get to that tie, you're gonna stop. And then I'm gonna curve out right here. When I get to the tie, I'm gonna stop. So if you're using a pencil, this is an, um, a line that you can erase right here where dad's um, shoulder was because your arm would be on top of that one. Now I'm at the marker, I can't erase it. So you're gonna draw your hand here. It's gonna go on top of dad's tie. Now, again, if you have a, a marker, you can't erase it, but if you have a pencil, you can erase that line of the tie. So I'm gonna start with my fingers. There's my pinky, ring finger, middle finger, pointer finger, thumb. We connect it back there, so I have a wrist. And then we're gonna draw a line straight across. It's got a, there's the line for your shirt sleeve. And then we're gonna add one more arm wrapped around on this side. So I'm gonna start right here on the um, curve of dad's face. Give a little curve and stop right there on his shoulder. And then same thing, we're gonna add your fingers. So we're gonna start with the thumb and then pointer, 
middle finger, ring finger, pinky finger, and attach it back up there to your wrist. So there's your second arm coming around, you're giving him a hug. All right, and then I have a little bit of space here between um, my head and dad's head, so I think I'm gonna add dad an ear. I'm giving one over here. And then this ear on, on my head is hidden, so I'm just gonna add an ear on this side. And then now that we have your arm here, dad needs two last details so that he has arms. So we're just gonna add a line straight down on both sides. And it looks like dad's got two arms and a body. Awesome. And then I'm gonna show you with another paper, different types of um, hairstyles that we can do. There's lots of different ones. All right, so we're gonna start with the boy hair. So here's my head, happy face. You might have hair that comes straight across. All right, here's another one. You might have curly hair. Here's another one. You might have this nice hair that stands up. Always looks super smooth. There we go. Try to make them all even there. Okay. Here's one for dad. Dad might have no hair. You can leave him with no hair. There's my faces. Okay, let's see. Here's a girl hair. You could do straight hair coming down. You might have curly hair or wavy hair. You can do some waves coming down. You might even have your hair in a ponytail. That works too. So in a ponytail, then I've got my hair here. Comes on my head a little bit. Little tri or I'm sorry, a little square for a um, hair tie. And you can draw your hair coming out. Maybe you can do wavy hair, or curly hair inside your ponytail. And then another one. Maybe you have some super curly hair. All hair is different. Good. And we'll come out here. You might even have your hair in a bun. That's fine. So I'm going to draw a little rectangle there. Get my hair again on my face. And then draw my bun. And the last one I have for you is some braids. Sometimes you have braids in your hair. So I'm going to do it on the sides of my head. And then two rectangles coming down. And I'm going to put X's all the way down so it looks like that hair is being braided. And then a little foofy at the end. So there's your different hairstyles. Whoops, there we go. Now remember, you want to make it look like your hair. So I would use a brown, maybe a light brown to do my hair. You could have black hair. You could have very, very blonde hair. So you might want to use a yellow. Um, you could have color hair. I don't know. You might have color strips in your hair. That would be cool. But I want you to make it look like you. And then I want you to make it look like dad. So think about what kind of hair dad has. Maybe dad even has some little spikes coming out. That's fine. You can give him little spikes. And that way, when it comes to Father's Day, you can give him your picture, and you can even write Happy Father's Day on the top. We'll switch colors. So I'll write Happy H A P P Y Fathers. Fathers is going to have that apostrophe S Day D A Y, and an exclamation mark because we're excited about it. All right, I can't wait to see him. You guys did awesome. Thank you for drawing with me today.